Hello, my name is Tom. Welcome back to my channel where we talk about news, reviews and rides going on in the PV community. In this episode, we're doing a live reaction to the One Wheel Uncharted. So let's check it out. Now one wheel, um, I've had two of them in the past. I've had the one wheel Pint and the one wheel XR. Both, I uh, love both of them very, very much. But the problem was the power and the range just didn't seem to be enough the way I like to ride. So this is gonna be a, hopefully an exciting time for a new chapter uh, for the one wheel. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna have the video playing. I'm gonna react as we go. But a couple of things we're looking for is increased uh, range and speed so a couple guesses that the community have got are that the one new one is going to be a new one wheel maybe with a new suspension system people are hoping with more power and more range obviously or it could be something which could be a budget option which could be um, reducing the price of the one wheel so be interested to see what's cooking up that future motion but my hope is that they have a bit more performance on the one wheels a bit more range a little bit more power because some of the other third party company companies out there um, are providing battery options for the XR and the Pint to basically improve the performance. So hopefully uh, Future Motion have finally released something new. But let's uh, check out the video now. Right, here we go, last couple seconds. Oh, please be something good. Please be something good. Just get the one more community back up on top again. Here we Hi go. Hi guys, Jamie Anderson here. What's up, friends? It's Chavis Flag here from Atlanta, yeah, Georgia. Yeah, guitar. One Wheel Guitar King. Yeah, that's it. I don't use my legs anymore. Lazy man. Massive thank you to One Wheel for adding so much fun and so much strength yeah, so to our must lives. be community and posts. To say thank you as well because there's some big influences in the One Wheel community for sure. My favorite part of the One Wheel is. It's that it fits on the wing strut of my airplane, what? so I have personal transportation anywhere I just land. Just strapped it and to his plane, that's it. To my heart is it reminds me so much of snowboarding and how easy it is to just pop in a flow state. I love snowboarding. I hear snowboarding you guys working feeling. on what's next, so I can't wait to see what you guys are up to. I know it's you say, insane, no one knew this was coming. People expected to come for ages. Who else is pumped on the new one wheel coming out? I'm psyching out of my mind. I can't wait to try it. I know. Oh, so it's definitely a new one wheel. We know that now. I want one wheel. See what I did right there? And I cannot wait to see this new board that they're coming out with. I have absolutely no idea what they're going to be doing, but I'm stoked to see it. Got my More. hair freaking spazzing out because I don't know what it is. What is it? Tell us. Let's go. EECs are performing amazingly. Why can't the one wheel do the same? Here we go. Uncharted. What is this going to be? Hi everyone, my name is Monica Elegram and this is One Wheel Uncharted. Here is my One Wheel story. I was born and raised on Maui and started surfing at a really young age and competing at 11. Surfing brought me around the world. It's all like to snowboarding and, and uh, in my hometown of surfing. Maui. Always. In 2013, my husband Ola and I started a small organic fruit farm called Ola Mana Organics. And one of our very first farm tools was the One Wheel. Before the one wheel, things were a lot harder and chores felt like chores. <laughs> After getting the one wheel, everything got To be got fair, I've used my one wheel for redecorating the house at times. The balance of Holding her back of the hands, really I don't think that's the way to go. And the one wheel jives perfectly between both of those worlds. On one hand, it's an excellent farm tool, and on the other, it's a vehicle for fun. And I hope this isn't I just really a story. I that changing for us anytime soon, and I absolutely can't wait to see where the innovation takes us. And with that, I'd like to introduce our chief evangelist and great friend, Jack Mudd. Thank you, Monica. Howdy, folks. I'm Jack, and I am incredibly excited to welcome you here to Uncharted. Why is this called Uncharted? Great question. Well, we're about to take you into new territory Come in the in. world. What we doing? I'm incredibly excited. Let's start with a question. Power. Well, Speed and range. Do we think about food and water, but if we have learned anything in these last 18 months, I would say that we've learned that we can't be looking at a zoom screen all day, and there's only so many puzzles that one can possibly do. We need joy in our lives. Happiness is important. 
You need to find those things that bring you joy and bring you happiness and prioritize those. Make sure you those <sighs> Still doing the Apple thing. Show us what you've done, please. For a lot of people, that has been one wheel. We've heard from so many folks. You know, I, I was excited. I saw it look cool. I bought a one wheel, but I didn't realize until I had it. What an amazing thing. Mental health. Mental health. Extremely it important. It gets you outside. It gets you off your screen. PVs right? help a lot with that. The world it allows you to really like tap into the full human experience. We pulled a quote, but we could have pulled from one of a hundred or more from Trent saying, my one wheel has been life changing. I purchased the one wheel to help get me out of the house more. And now I'm riding 10 to 15 miles every single day. It's done so much for my mental health. It's because you only could do 10 to 15 miles at the this moment. One wheel is a tool for people to help discover joy. It's a tool to help it's them definitely tool to get yourself out of there themselves and make their people. And their body. And <coughs> it's a tool to help you connect with your environment, to get outside, to feel fresh air, to move. It's such a nice, complete PV. No and remote, it also is a tool to no issues. With just others. go, go, go. Now, one of the things we hear so much is just how tight knit the one wheel community is. How many relationships mm, have There's a tight knit community, but they're not happy with copyright strikes all the time, guys. This riding experience. But it's this is probably nice. one of the most amazing stories in the one wheel community. This is uh, Meals on One Wheels, a yeah. organization that pairs grass. Big props to Meals on One Wheels. One wheel community legends. Has them come together to collect clothing and food and deliver that to unhoused neighbors in their community. I got a chance to be a part of a couple of these in San Jose and, and Santa Cruz, and it is so special. The joy that is there and the joy that they are spreading to others, it's something that gets you fired up. Mm. And this is a community that's growing quite quickly, right? This last year we've Yeah, because I've got the stats to record how many miles everyone's done. I think I've done about pretty remarkable stats. six, seven now, thousand or something on my own. What our Who knows? job is. Our job is to create a product that ushers in this epic experience, this magical, joy-inspiring, at times- It is a very nice feeling on a one wheel. Experience to people, but it's also Come to make on. it accessible. And in our last product launch, the that's pint. what we did. It was good. One wheel pint. And people absolutely love- It was a good one wheel pint, 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 but you just want an XR. And the only thing that we hear is, I wish I could experience it a little bit longer. Yes. Well, listen. Finally. And today, it's I'm a very new pint. excited to introduce to you Here a brand new One Wheel Pint X. What? One Wheel Pint X? That's it. This is it. The One Wheel Pint X. That's the big innovation. You're joking. One Wheel Pint X. There needs to be an XRX. If there's not an XRX, what so is what going on? What is new with the One Wheel Pint X? Well, somehow we were able to take the specs of the One Wheel Plus XR, and thanks to the miracles of modern science, we were able to jam that into the compact form factor of One Wheel Pint. Oh, please, of an XRX. The sweet spot board that is both. Is it the same price? It can't be more money. It can't be more money. Inconvenient. Now, first off, we need to talk about range. 12 to 18 miles per charge. All of a sudden, you're able to ride all day. In our all day for 12 tests. miles. Now I'm about 200 pounds. I was yeah, you can show me this. I ain't believe in any range until it's in the community's hands. I'm and sorry. That, that's usually a car trip, right? But with 12 to 18 miles. In range, one wheel pint X is capable of doing that, and I had a great time. Let's talk about speed. That's right, range speed. is not all. One wheel pint X gets 18 miles per hour top speed. Ooh. Now, that's two miles per hour faster than one wheel pint. You wow. Asking, two, miles. two miles an hour? Why does that matter? Yes, why does it matter? That's because, for me, a comfortable cruising speed when I'm going places is around. 12, 13, 14, maybe 15 miles per hour. And that's what those two additional miles per hour give you. That's a big innovation. Two miles an hour. Cool. You're able to go places. And quicker. like it really takes four more miles range. City. That's really the big innovation for future motion. To go places oh faster. my God. Well, let's talk about size. We're able to give you that oh, level please of performance have another wheel in the same this, compact size that one wheel pint is. 27 inches from tip to tip. 
It's also got this built-in mag handle. It right can't be more money. If it's more money, like you failed. What does this all mean? <laughs> Sorry. Well, we were in New York City the other day shooting uh, our launch video, and hands down, this is the board that I want in any urban environment. You're on the train. You're coming out of the train. Yeah, that makes sense for a city runner. Yeah, that's cool. You, this is probably the smallest, most compact, and dare I say, the most fun rideable that is available for public consumption. Small enough to take with you, capable enough. Oh my to God, go if this is it. I feel like I don't need to even say this, but the thing is incredibly fun. Now, that's, that's what this it's is It's the about. same thing. One wheel Pint X, Carvey, <sighs> Zippy, more speed, more range. You're gonna have- More speed and range, what, two miles an hour? I can say that, that I have. So- Same now, price, probably has to be same you know, price. If it's more money, game over. That. One wheel Pint X checks in at $1,400. Now you're getting the How much is that in pounds? Plus XR, but at fourteen hundred. How much is that in pounds? The size of pint. It's really this this Goldilocks board. And if you want, you can finance it. That's right. We have Klarna options available on our website. It's, it's about the same. Thousand seventeen pounds. Seventy eight dollars per month. I always say for two miles an hour. Seventy eight dollars of fun per month. Two miles an That's hour. Your fault. It's not ours. If you are able to purchase one in the next 48 hours, you can save up to $200 on bundles. That's right, you can get on bundles. everything you need for your brand new Pint X. Everything you need, right? Discount. So that means I you can get the charger book they don't out. give you, and the fender they don't give you. Tap in to the launch code. Oh my God, what is this? Tennis ball yellow, neon If this is it, way, if this is stuff. the big innovation, uh, holy hell. The next 48 hours, so make sure uh, you get yours while you still can. Oh my the next question you have though. is probably when can I get this? Well, oh, please don't I'm tell me that this is it. To inform you that you can actually get this today. That's right, we have One Wheel Pint X boxed up and available, ready to ship from our factory in San Jose, California. So folks, One Wheel Pint X, pound for pound, probably the best value that you can get. Please have a looking, One Wheel X X. On fence, you're thinking, when is One Wheel coming out with something new? This is an amazing combination of speed. If of this range, is it, holy hell. Compact size and an amazing experience, all at a price that is really unbeatable. And I am so it's a good price. to get your pine Is that enough, though? And go hit the streets. Thank you. If don't tell me this is it. For joining me here today. This has been fun. But we actually have one more. Please thing have the you. new X. Founder and CEO, if it's Tyler. not, oh my God. Please, please have something better. <laughs> Here we go, Mr. Lawsuit. Thanks, Jack. I think people are going to be riding Pint X's all over the place. It's going to be amazing. It's the perfect way to zoom through your city. It just builds on all the momentum. Please pint. have something better than a one more pint. pint. You know, one of the things for please. me when I think about uh, what One Wheel is, is that it's always been rooted in um, creating a new board sport. For me, I was motivated by snowboarding on powder growing up in Western Canada. This is my happy place. For other people, it's being on a wave on the ocean, um, which is an amazing feeling. And I know, it's like snowboarding, I like surfing, it's cool. Just... So when I think about what a board sport is, it's about exploration, it's about playfulness. We talked about this just it's now, come on. And for anybody that does board sports, they know exactly what I'm talking about. Yes. And if you, it's fun. if one wheel is your first board sport, get a one wheel and you'll start experiencing these things. Uh, starting about two years ago, uh, we said, let's sit down and let's um, you know, go back to the drawing board and create a new one wheel that's specifically- If there's a one wheel that does 20 miles, happy days. That's all you need, all you need. We set out with a blank sheet. 20 um, miles, You know, Done. XR is kind of like a one wheel plus, which is kind of like the original one wheel. But this time we said, hey, let's, let's just- <laughs> There's like a one wheel pint, but just a little bit like the one wheel pint. A lot in the last number of years. And um, let's make an ultimate new flagship. And so Thank you. what did that product need to have? More range, uh, more have, power. Uh, more range. More range, more speed. Uh, range is one of the most important things that people ask. The thing is with one, we need more uh, range so you go a little bit faster because you don't want to nosedive. Partly because people are going on huge rides, uh, but also because it's just peace of mind. I'll please uh, be a new one with XRX. Kind of vehicle, if it's an XRX. You're get where you set out to go and then get home. X. More power. RS or something? Who doesn't like more power? But in a, in a one wheel application, more power is uh, actually not just your zero to 60 time, 
it's uh, from zero to sixty. More, you're not getting sixty on a one wheel. Tell that. It's the ability to ride new lines on new terrain. So more power was a key um, thing that we were looking to add to this product. Oh, please don't and be rubbish. More rideability. So as people have gotten better at riding one wheels, pushed the limits, tried different things. Um, you know, we've really set the bar higher for what a next generation product needs to be. And so I'm very excited Here we today go. Come to on. introduce the product that delivers on all these, the one wheel mm. GT. Evolve? <laughs> what? Evolve GT? Ooh. Oh, I like that rail. Ooh. Oh, okay. Is this the thing? GT. Hmm. GT is totally redesigned. It doesn't really share any parts with XR. Or it's got no charging port though. We are given the design freedom to really start over and design our dream board. It's an aggressive product. It's designed for shredding in the room. Okay, room. is this and, what we need? Uh, there's a lot of features that <sighs> Please make be better. it perfect for that kind of use. But it also cleans up nice, <laughs> and it's a, it's a great looking product. I'm really happy with the new design language we were able to bring in to the GT line. So let's talk features. Okay, we go. Starting with the battery. 20S2V? The battery is really the core of a one wheel. And the battery for GT is by far the most powerful battery we've ever made. Uh, it uses 21700 mm -hmm. battery cells, which are a larger cell Standard, than the no. 18650s we've used in the past. 217. They pack considerable more energy and power. They um, produce more 20. power over their whole state of charge. 18S2? 18S3? longer overall. But we didn't just switch to a larger cell. We are also using more of them, which allows us to run at a higher voltage. And higher voltage um, translates. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What's that number? Fifty-two. Better ride. Is it, shut up! That's fifty-two. GT features no. a thirty-two mile range. Yes. Over sixty percent more range. Thirty-two miles. And it's yes. Going to enable people to go on some amazing adventures. Finally. With more voltage in the battery pack, that allows us to enhance the power band. Oh, thank and God for that. The power band is really how much power <sighs> the uh, motor and the battery and the control system Finally. at different speeds. So this Forget is about the point, this is what you XR, want. Which, if you've ridden one, is pretty powerful. And you can see that it produces um, a lot of power at medium This is all they needed to do. GT <laughs> produces considerably more power. Um, up to but what's it? More power and RPM, speed, but um, no numbers. Extending that power Graph doesn't mean anything about numbers. Speeds, which just means that you can have a more confident ride and um, you can ride on terrain that you might never have been able to in the past. For the first time, we're introducing concave front and rear foot pads. Yes, um, like this the concave. Required us to solve some pretty interesting uh, technical uh, problems with how do you make a foot pad sensor that can actually work on a concave surface. We solved those problems with GT, um, and we also uh, cover the concave with uh, much grippier grip tape uh, that, than we've ever used in the past. Of course, a grit helps you stay on in all conditions. Okay, good and grip tape. The benefit tape. of concave really is that you. Your foot is flexed and pushing nice. against it. Keeps you locked in when you're riding How much? on trails or over bumps. It can't be over uh, it is also just more comfortable 2K? for rides. Meg Handle Pro 2, is something we available as an accessory for XR 200. Pine. Top whack. Um, but I'm happy to introduce Mac it. Handle GT, Pro. Mag Handle Pro is actually included. Should Mac be. Handle Pro is um, aluminum cast handle uh, with over-molded rubber for comfortable carrying. It's really strong. And for the first time, um, MagHandle Pro is available in colors, uh, which you can configure in our online store. How's that the, the first time? They've had colored handles before. The ride quality on a one wheel. On Pint, you've got a narrower, more round tire. On XR, you have a wider, more straight across tire. And with GT, we really wanted to create the best of both worlds. So mm. it's basically the same width as an XR tire. But rounded. A similar rounded profile. Oh, thank God. Nice. And what that creates no more tire swaps. is the ability to carve really deep and easily rail the board um, from side to side, but also gives you great secondary stability and is super stable while you're riding around. I thought it should be the one mobile pie dance. I know a lot of people are going to be really excited about. Change tires? For the first time ever, you we're can buy a treaded tire. Ooh. This is the same tire profile 
Okay, well, nice. Fred, um, it looks nice, man. It looks like a um, switchblade, like a knife or something. Or just a little additional confidence. Jisei's awful name, though. Um, super excited about this one. Terrible name. And it's available uh, straight from the factory. LED lights. Uh, oh, I have bl if these lights are garbage. The, the first generation. Yeah, the pint lights um, are terrible. But with GT, we made them significantly brighter. Good. So the LED lights, Thank the lights are over 300% brighter. Thank than you. On our previous generation product. So you can really see where what you're going. What product is brighter um, than the XR or the Pine? Seen. In fact, they're so bright, we had to add a setting in the app that lets you dial them back because they're so so bright um, for other people that you're, you're riding around. And all this just to make a board that rides amazingly and you can just send it out in the world. GT has a full line of accessories available for okay. it. Okay, never stand, so most have to buy that you need to do one of every time. One wheel accessories. Um, Should be GT an accessory. we actually designed with the Fender uh, in mind from the beginning. Um, so it's super integrated, super integrated into the form. Um, and it's As an additional purchase. An essential accessory. An essential accessory which you don't get with the one wheel, that guaranteed. People who put a lot of miles on one wheels have a lot of opinions about. And one of the most common things that they want is a bit more uh, tail kick in order to, uh, you know, just give you a point of reference as you're riding, particularly on trails um, or if you're riding fast. And so we have available today uh, a high kick rear foot pad for GT. And one, one more piece of so many accessories um, that we're debuting today yeah. is what we call the love hump. So we were uh, working in the shop one afternoon and we were thinking, hey, what would make uh, the rear foot pad even more comfortable for long distance riding? And we, we started gluing up some okay. um, pieces of material and realized that some arch support would actually you know, make it a lot more comfortable. So. This foot pad combines arch support, concave, and higher kick. I think a lot of people are going to really enjoy riding with that foot pad because it's super comfortable, um, particularly for longer rides. How much and is of course, standard? We have a hypercharger available for GT um, with a battery that big. Of course, it takes a little bit longer to charge. And so but we don't give you that. Possible charge time. We don't give you that. The charger is a great option um, so that you can get back riding for another lap. GT is a new flagship product for us. It incorporates the best features from anything we built before, as well as a lot of new things and a lot of premium upgrades. It has over 60% more range than XR. It's got concave foot pads integrated and nice. the handle pro included. Um, and all that is available for a price point starting at $2,200. Uh, $2,200. We also, of course, have financing available. Oh, no, stop trying to get people into debt. Which will allow you to pay on a monthly payment program. And GT will start shipping within the next few months. In English money. So 16 is the same money. Of course, ship nice. in order that uh, orders were received. And so you need to get in early if you want to be riding as soon as possible. Um, also, we've got some great launch bundles that are only available for the next 48 what hours. What is up with these so bundles, man? Bundle bundles, accessories, bundle finance. The Don't like it. is uncharted. But where people are going to take Pint X and GT is going to be amazing. I hope you're as excited as I am about these next generation products. Yep. And the evolution. Nice. The good products. price. The future is rad. Nice. Is that us done? That is us done. Is that done? It's done. Cool. Okay, right, so that is us done. So, a bit of a um, review. Why did he say GT in the comments? Okay, right, so conclusion. One more pint X. What's the point? It's the same thing, just with two miles an hour, high speed, um, and uh, a little bit more range. So that's really not that impressive. One wheel GT, not impressed the name. Looks really, really, really nice uh, price points good but then it doesn't mean it's a straight up it's um conversion from dollars to pounds so because regional prices are different but yeah one more gt quite impressed so uh, drop in the comments below what you think of the new boards do you reckon they're worth buying or would you be more inclined to like mod like an xr or something or a pint to kind of get the same kind of specs so your opinion below 
But if you stayed along to the end, I'll say thank you very much. I hope you've enjoyed the experience with me. Uh, it's been a bit of a high and low, so it's interesting. But I'll say thank you very much for watching. Subscribe for more content. It comes out on a weekly basis. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.